This storm is expected to make landfall on the Florida Peninsula, uh, the west coast of Florida, sometime late Wednesday evening, maybe early Thursday morning in the wee hours is kind of where it's looking now. I've been briefed by the senior leaders of this administration uh, and uh, who are driving our preparedness for Hurricane Milton, which uh, could be one of the worst storms in 100 years in hit Florida. Uh, today I held the joint call with state legislative leaders and the cabinet to brief them on Florida's uh, uh, efforts uh, on the storm and about our resources that are being offered. And I directed this team to do everything it can to save lives and our communities, help our communities before, during, and after these extreme weather events. Uh, and, uh, and that's being done. I've spoken to all the political leaders in the region, some of them more than once, and uh, they, uh, they, I've told them anything they ask for they can get. Most importantly, I've urged everyone, everyone, currently located in Hurricane Milton's path to listen to local officials and follow the safety instructions. We have hundreds of state search and re rescue personnel, a total of 26 teams embedded in potential impact sites along the West Coast to begin immediate rescue operations as soon as the storm passes, should the need arise.